Hey guys, it's Jamie here from 3D Scan Store, and in this video, I just want to very quickly show you how I used Rap3's lattice node to transfer the clothing from our samurai mesh onto our uh, big guy Hulk model. Uh, one thing to bear in mind with this is you do need to have the two base meshes using the same topology and point order. So basically what I've done here is load the samurai with all his component parts into Wrap 3 along with the Hulk or big guy's uh, body base mesh. I'm just going to add a lattice node here and I'm going to plug the armor into the first node and I'm just going to set this neighbors to 200. It gives you slightly more accurate results. And now I'm going to plug the samurai into the second node and the Hulk into the third node. And now you'll see this actually very quickly transfers the clothing, that element of the clothing, onto the Hulk. So now I'm just um, doing that with all of the uh, components, the helmet, the cloth, the masks, and just creating some save nodes. And I'm just going to export these as OBJs. And now just quickly, just to show how this works, I've loaded it into ZBrush here so you can see all the parts in place. I actually did a few little tweaks on this because um, there were a few intersecting parts, but, you know, that was only a few seconds work. And now here we have the models in Marmoset. So I've just loaded in the elements that I exported from Wrap. And now all I have to do is copy across the shaders from the Samurai onto the models from the uh, Wrap 3 export. Again, just do the same for the head and the helmet. And there it is, finished. A very, very quick process. Um, apart from a few little tweaks in ZBrush, this is more or less exactly how I did it. Probably took me about five minutes in total um, and that's it really if you've got any questions feel free to stick them in the comments below i hope it's helpful cheers